There are concerns this afternoon over changes to the federal government's home care packages, which allow thousands of older Australians to live at home for longer. The government last month made changes to the scheme and what residents are able to claim. And for more this afternoon, we're joined by Kira Basnell, founder and director of Care About in Melbourne. Kira, thank you for your time. Break this down for us. What are the changes? Look, there's been um, quite a lot of regulatory changes in home care and in aged care homes. In home care, the biggest changes that occurred from January the 1st were to do with a cap on the prices that home care providers can charge. And this has actually been a really, really good thing for families who are wanting to remain living at home. When prices could be determined and be up to 40, 50% of a home care package, they're now capped at 35%. And some of the things that I think that people are worried about is what can be paid for out of the home care package, so what's included and what's actually excluded. Almost 75,000 people are in home care programs across New South Wales alone. This program's really essential to keeping the pressure off the aged care system and also allowing those older Australians to live at home and be happy where they, where they are. Absolutely. It's an incredibly um, important uh, part of funding in order to support people to remain living in the way that they want to live at home. And we do know that all of the person's well-being, their health needs are going to be much better if they can be supported well at home. So if they are one of the lucky ones and they have got a home care package, then uh, they can actually access these services. But what people are worried about right now are the changes that came into place from the start of this year about how you can actually use those funds and there have been some changes about what's included and what's excluded that can be paid for out of those home care package funds. Mobility scooters for one they're really important to allow people to stay in their homes what would happen if they were cut out? Look, absolutely. So I care about, we know we speak to thousands of people and um, mobility scooters are essential to be able to keep people connected to their homes um, and their local communities. So mobility scooters are, you know, are, are an important um, equipment that is used by people in um, home care. So it's unclear whether or not mobility scooters can be supported in the home care package. At the moment, we, we know that they're definitely not excluded. So is there enough awareness out there about the packages that are available to allow older Australians to stay in their homes? Look, absolutely, there is not enough awareness around the home care package program. And often when there is awareness around it, it's actually too late and someone has no other option but to go into an aged care home. We would love uh, the government to spread the word to apply early for a home care package and to access the really generous funding that we have in Australia. Well, Kira, thank you so much for your time and for clearing, clearing up some of the confusion. Thanks so much.